Hi, it's Mrs. Earl again, and today we're talking about dividing with powers. Our first example today is 4 to the 6th power divided by 4 to the 2nd power. Now another way of showing division is by using the division bar. So if we rewrite the problem as 4 to the 6th power divided by 4 to the 2nd power, we can then look at the numerator as 4 times 4 times 4 times 4 times 4 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 times 4. And then we can look at the denominator as 4 times 4. Well, if this were just a simple division problem, you might notice that 4 divided by 4 is 1. They, in fact, cancel each other out. If we move it over, we have 4 divided by 4 is also 1. And all we have left is 1, 2, 3, 4, fours. So therefore, our answer is 4 to the 4th power. Let's look at a second example. Let's look at 6 to the 3rd power divided by 6 to the second power. Again, we rewrite the problem in, ex in fraction form. 3 to the 6th divided, I'm sorry, 6 to the 3rd divided by 6 to the 2nd. When we write that out in expanded form, we have 6 times 6 times 6 divided by 6 times 6. Again, 6 divided by 6 is 1. 6 divided by 6 is 1 leaving us just one six. So our answer is six to the first power, but because it's only one six, we don't need to write the exponent. Again, there is a shortcut that we could use. Going back to our first example, you notice that we removed two, because there were two fours in the denominator, we removed two fours from the numerator. What we could say is, 4 to the 6th power minus 4, 4 to the 2nd power, and that equals 4 to the 4th power. In our second example, it would be 6 to the 3rd power minus 6 to the 2nd power, because we removed, again, we removed two 6s, and our answer is 6 to the 1st power. Now here's an example for you to try on your own. Press pause, work out the solution, and then press play and see if you got it right. 7 to the 10th power divided by 7 to the 3rd power. Using the shortcut, we would say 10, oh, 7 to the 10th power minus 7 to the third power, which equals 7 to the seventh power. Remember, when you're writing your exponents, make them small and make the base large. I hope this was helpful. Happy calculating.